providing active support over time. All right, enjoy your drink. I've supported Laura since she came to the service five years ago. First day I met Laura, she was quite a happy young lady um, until we asked her to participate in some things. There was a lot of um, disengagement. She watched a lot more than what she actually did. And she um, wasn't used to being supported in the way that we, we do the active support here. With Laura, uh, we started choice and control with concrete objects for her to be able to see and connect the choice that was being offered to her. Yeah, we've got our jug. We use Lillian often quite a bit throughout Laura's day, giving her small amounts of time to get used to something, but regularly. So the first day might be, here you go, here's the paintbrush, and she'll hand it to me. And then the next time I showed her how to use the paintbrush. That's how we kept progressing mm -hmm. over time. Good work, Laura. I started to pick up on things that were working with Laura and for Laura and what Laura was accepting in terms of support. And then we built from there. It was just through noticing, trying things, thinking about it, reflecting, you know, what worked this time, what didn't work so well. Could it work if we changed a little bit of it? It's just been a process over the last five years of going through those motions with her. It's moved from a lot of physical support, hand over hand style, to now not as much of that, to more encouragement and letting Laura do it on her own. I've seen a big difference in Laura. From when she first started from being disengaged most of the time to now she's very happy and quite social. She has to say hello to everyone when she gets in. She's very comfortable. There's a huge difference. She'll show us that she's having a good time and she's enjoying the process. She'll laugh. She gets quite affectionate. She can, you know, touch your arm or your hand. Good. I think Laura and I have learned a lot from each other. It's not just Laura has been learning from me. Good job. Well done.